Welcome, welcome, welcome. Please don't forget to press on the subscribe button. Press on the subscribe button and then make sure you share the video with family and friends. It is very important to share with them. Today on our sociology lecture, we are looking at power of a sexy night wear and good looks. Wow. The power of a sexy night wear and good looks. You see, there are so many problems in the home, eh? Some fight that if women take note of sexy ways, those problems will have been solved. Let's take for instance that your husband is angry with you. Okay. And then um, he's in the bedroom after bathing, you go there and then you go and rest. And then you pretend uh, as if you, know, you, are, you, are, you are applying public. And then you, you, you face him with your, with your, your bottles. That's all. They fight over their way, telling you. You see, we can make our marriage sweet with these facts i am going to share with you it's as i say it's a lecture so be ready to listen to the end but don't forget to subscribe to the channel very important now, you see when you are home as a woman you must wear what what we call skimpy you know sexy dresses and then underwears so you can find an underwear which are very, you know, um, nice and attractive. That will attract your husband. It's very important. Because if your husband, you make his eye be on you, no side chick, I'm telling you, will come your way. In fact, in the home, dress to kill. <laughs> even before a strange woman comes there, take note of that. And then, you see, women, there's a woman, even when they are home, they are always, you know, with this cloth on them, on to make kind of seem okay, wrap herself with this cloth and some of them wrap her around their waist. Hey, babe, our dear ladies, it is not good. It makes you look like you know, uh, you know, an 18th century person, and it's not the best at all. At all, so women, let's dress up in front of our men, okay, when we are home. The kids are not there. Let's say you have not given birth, or even if you have given birth and then you are with your husband at home while the kids are not there, you can walk in front of him naked and to pull your husband's mind to the home always. You see, have you two read that it was says that they were naked and were not ashamed? So sometimes I wonder why some women quickly, when they see that their husbands are coming to the bedroom, they quickly want to cover themselves. Meanwhile, you are married to the person. Oh, babe, dear woman, let's take note of this one. Because these points I'm giving you are very important. Let's take note of that. Okay, so he's your husband, so there's no need to be shy of him at all. And then, bath together. It is a very important point. Bath together, eat together, you know, play together because he's your husband and then get involved in kissing find time to kiss more you know massaging fondling you know and then make it a habit to sleep without what panties except during menstruation so as a woman okay whenever you're going to sleep go without pants in fact it's a tip i'm giving you if you take note of this point it will help your marriage because it's a moment they when they're going to sleep they have these, you know, jeans on it. What are you going to do with the jeans on, on their face? There's no need. Put them down. Go and sleep on dress on the bed to help your marriage. And then invite him for a what? A successful night. So invite your husband. Okay. You see, when you are in your night where that he can see through, what I call see me through. It's a way of inviting him. 
we sometimes it's not always saying it, but the way you you actually you know pulls into your body whilst you are undressed, you are, it will maybe call you to husband and to help your, your marriage life. Very important. And then tell tell him how you will win him on the bed. So sometimes you need to discuss your husband. You smile, you see, and then smile too is a good look. There are some women they don't like smiling, but start smiling, see, and then pull your husband. Say, yes, huh, today there will be much. Today you're going to enjoy. It is very important. Yeah, and then make it a habit to communicate with him about your sex life. Talk to your husband, okay? Because when the sex life is not going well, some women they are not happy at home because of the sex life. You know, talk to your husband. Discuss with him. Let him know the problems you are going through. So that you know he can empathize with you and then make amends by clicking on the subscribe button for more. So don't forget to subscribe for more. And then be creative. Okay, and then do different styles that are convenient for both of you. There are some people what they know is only missionary. No, you must learn different you know, sex positions as counselor perfect have taught us. We have the free barrel, we have the cowbell, and, and all that. They are all the going from counselor perfect, you know. And then you see, one thing is that you must appreciate your man very well and then never keep quiet whenever you are in, in the act. And then don't, there are some women to be lie down as wood. Don't talk. No, talk to your husband. Enjoy your marriage. It's very important. I know you're going to take this point, the lecture I'm giving you seriously, for your marriage to stand strong. Don't forget to subscribe and to share. Until then, see you again. Bye-bye.